happy Sabbath, Mount Olivet SDA Church. Welcome to our weekly worship experience. I am Cynthia Murray, and you're watching MOSDA News. We gently remind you to place your cell phone on vibrate or silent to ensure there will be no interruptions as you worship with us today. Please refrain from walking down the center aisle during service due to the live stream via YouTube and Facebook. We encourage you to advise your friends and family internationally to join us for worship on our YouTube channel at Mount Olivet SDA Church, Fort Lauderdale. Please refrain from eating or drinking in the sanctuary. If there is a need to do either, we encourage you to do so in the wing of the church where there are appropriate accommodations. Together, we will keep the sanctuary as clean as possible. Thank you for adhering to these requests. On February 10th, the Mount Olivet Young Adult Ministries presents Love Island, where love meets reality. A panel of married, engaged, and dating couples, along with singles, will discuss love and relationships. This is a discussion you don't want to miss right here at the place. Join us here at Mount Olivet Seventh-day Adventist Church, 649 Northwest 15th Way, Fort Lauderdale, Florida, 33311. Attention parents of children aged four through nine. The Star Blazers need you. Registration for the 2024 club year is open. Our first club meeting will be today at 4 p.m. Please contact Kafina Archer or Carrie Ann Williams to register your child. The Sabbath School Council meeting will take place tomorrow at 10 a.m. It will be in person in the wing of the church. Please arrive on time. Again, that's 10 a.m. It is time for us to update our birthday list. Please send a message to our clerk, Hygeta Hyatt, with your full name and birthday via email or phone. We need this updated information. And married couples, we want to celebrate you as well. Please send your anniversary to the clerk so that we may build that database. Business owners, we want to patron your business. If you own a business and wish to be spotlighted and become a part of our business directory, we want to hear from you. Simply email your information, a photo, your website, and contact information to JackieVernonThompson at gmail.com. This will be a great marketing resource. This is for business owners only. It is always a joy to sow seeds into the work of God. During service, you will have the opportunity to make a financial contribution. You have a variety of options to make contributions via email, our website, and dropping it off right here at the church. We are excited to announce a fourth convenient option, and that is via Zelle. Take note, at any time, you may make your contribution via Zelle to give to mosda at gmail.com. Give the number to mosda at gmail.com. It's simple and easy to use, and we thank you in advance. Please pray for Joshua Harry. He will compete in the Bible Bowl at the First Church of West Palm Beach this afternoon. Joshua is one of our superstars. Let's lift him up in prayer that he may demonstrate his Bible knowledge with confidence and assurance that with God, all things are possible. We are delighted to celebrate the birthdays of a few of our members. We failed to celebrate two very important January birthdays last week. Last Sabbath was Sinkethia Griffin's birthday, and Monday, the 29th, was Cynthia Holmes' birthday. We wish this mother-daughter duo a most wonderful birthday. February birthdays are as follows. Today, February 3rd, Farrah Murray. Happy Sabbath birthday. Faye Davis and Talia Foreman will celebrate on the 4th, Crystal Smith Merritt, February 5th, and Sheila Harry, February 9th. We wish you all a wonderful birthday. Don't forget to pause during each day to whisper a prayer. If you must set a reminder in your phone, I encourage you to do so. Remember that midday prayer matters and that prayer changes things. You know what they say, more prayer, more power. That's all the news for us today. Be sure to have an enjoyable Sabbath and God bless you.